that's going to be sturdy enough. I think that's a kick bed. No, we'll get some folks in here. What's up, Mike? Hey, Kyle, how you doing, sir? Good to catch you. Hold on, we're trying to get this all settled. What's up, Chris? What's up, Alex? What's up, Damien? How y'all doing, guys? Hold on, I'm trying to get this braced. Turn the TV down real quick. Hey, Damien. Hey, Alex. Thanks, Mike. Appreciate it, bro. You got your phone on you. It's well, it's charging. Would you message my wife and tell her what we're doing? We're on live right now. Yeah, I guess. I'm glad you're hanging tough, Damien. They didn't let me title this video. That's kind of weird. Anyways, y'all, we're going to be doing this. As, this is one of our update videos. Uh, we're going to talk about a few things. I've got mainly a lot to talk about. He is with his aunt. Calm down, ma'am. What's up, Tyler? Hey, Zach. So I'm going to let a couple people join. We'll go over some updates real quick. Um, you have to Facebook or she's at work. Oh, well, that's dumb. <laughs> oh, there's Justin finally. Hey, FNG. <laughs> By the way, y'all, Justin's nickname is FNG. Just for the record. Freaking new guy. That's okay. He helped me out. Helped me out a lot this weekend. Woman, you don't need to see him right now. Let us do us our job. Tyler, I'm getting my hair cut this weekend, Boba. What's up, Casey? How you doing, man? <laughs> yes, Tyler, I agree. My dear wife, our child is eating right now, so I'm not going to show you him. <clears throat> oh, boy. Casey, I need you to give me a holler sometime, brother. I want to talk to you about some stuff. What's up, Derek? I'm Alex, not, I am not doing the mullet. I am. It's okay. I'm not shaving my head. I'm not cutting my hair. Don't worry. Addy CJ, how you doing, It'll be back sir? soon, Alex. It'll be back soon. If I could let my wife, talk my wife and let me grow it out, I would. But, yeah, she said no. Well, that's because you're uh, not on the camera, Justin. See, you had to work, I think. I don't know, but you're not here. Tune up for the cut man, free beer while you get... Go to tune up for the cut man. Free beer while you're getting trimmed up. Huh. I'll have to check him out, Tyler. Sounds good, Casey. Appreciate it, brother. So what are we on here to talk about now? Updates. Son, you got a bird first. Sorry. Send it on the mullet, really, Justin. Focus. I'm the only one Focus. here with the kid. Focus. Okay, okay. What? Pay attention to your video. Let me take care of the baby. Okay. Focus. <laughs> no, Charlie, you are not cutting it. I'm getting it cut this weekend. <laughs> Don't worry. Yes, do it. Just after till hunting this weekend, hopefully. Hey, Jen. Hey, Greg. How y'all doing? All right, we got enough people on here. We're going to give a little update. First off, I want to give a huge shout out to our sponsors. Uh, I actually got to finally use the decoy rigs this weekend. I'm sorry I didn't get a video of it, but the GoPro is stashed right this second because someone's moving and we have to find it. So, 
whatever. We, we, we will get it up up there, and we will get some videos up there. I might have a new camera soon. Yeah, same here. So. Yeah, same here. So We'll have some video. We'll have some video. We're going to be working on cameras. No, Alex, I'm not letting them cut it. I promise, brother. Um, update on the decals. For y'all that have always already paid for a decal. Hey, Crystal. How you doing, hon? Anyways, y'all that have already paid for a decal, I am having to find a new decal guy right this second. Um, I gave the other guy a chance. He's a dang good friend of mine. He's got a lot going on, though. He switched jobs, so... I'm in the process of trying to work deals out with another person right now. The same kind of deal we had. It was a great deal. Um, maybe they'll hook us up like they like Will did. Uh, I mean, huge shout out to Will for everything he did for us already. He put our flyer together for the duck hunt we did you know, on in back in July. We did a giveaway back then uh, for an autism awareness event. He's made our logos. I'll talk to him still if he does graphic designs, but as of right now, he hasn't done anything with decals, so I'm having to find another source. I think I already have CJ. I just got to get a hold of him, to be honest with you, sir. I haven't had time to yet. And if I remember right, it's almost the same deal I had worked out with Will. So send me that guy's name one more time, if you will, CJ, and I'll, I'll look him up. It's new, new time decals for you. What's up, Damien? What, what were you trying to say, brother? No, uh, I don't know. I I think you mistyped. I don't know, brother. I'm not mean to be rude. But anyways, um, so cameras are in the works. <laughs> now he is. <laughs> um, decals are coming out. Read between the lines, Charlie. Hey, hey, professional, sir. Professional. He's not professional. He is, too. <laughs> hey, Will, what's going on, brother? That is not the same Will, by the way, y'all, I'm talking to. Another thing, shirts. I've got five designs. Well, we've got five designs for shirts. So as soon as we find someone that will do the designs the way we want them, we're going to start bringing out shirts big time. Um, we got a few of the religious quote shirts because, as y'all know, we're Christians, it's what we are. We pray before every on the first day of every opening season. We pray in our videos when we do videos, usually, unless we're giving you a quick update, obviously. All right, CJ, I will. But uh, got some also some funny one, uh, a funny one or two, and we got we just got some good ones. So shut up, Justin. I gotta read comments. Okay, Damien, I got you, brother. I appreciate it. Okay, Crystal, send me a link to them. I'll look them up. I haven't talked to you about the shirt guy yet, CJ, so we'll talk about that too, brother. Um, just message me tomorrow, CJ, because I'm about to go to bed with the little one. But shirt designs are coming out. Um, also, um, we are now looking for more sponsors. Um, we're reaching out to people, obviously, but if you think you have a good company that would sponsor us, send us a, get us in, in contact with them. When you do that, I will sit there and get y'all a decal and we'll figure out some kind of other little thing to do for them. I mean, it's fair enough. Y'all helped us. We're going to help y'all. If you're local, you might get a chance to go duck hunting with us or dove hunting with us. So there's a heads up guys. I mean, if you're local. Well, we're, we're down to travel a couple hours away, too, for duck hunting, as long as we got lodging. And then we'll, we'll figure out lodging, for sure, if we need to. But um, other than that, teal season's coming to a close this weekend. Uh, we're going to try to hit it hard Saturday. As long as I don't work, I know Royce is still going if I don't go, obviously. so Someone's, someone's got to show them how to shoot ducks. They can't shoot ducks, apparently. Hey, I dropped the one I aimed at on the first shot. Thank you. How many did you come home with? One. How many did you see? How saw a group, group of five, and then we saw another group of five that flared off. So yeah, that yeah. wasn't that. Yeah. I, the why, you, why, did they, why did they flare off? Because I was standing up looking for ducks. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Rookie. Anyways, um, <laughs> bow season starts in October, though. Um, so ready. For 
I know Royce is extremely ready for so it. Ready. I've got to dial my bow in some more. Me and Royce have been trying to work on mm. it, but it's going to take some. Take some work. Take some work. We'll get it. We'll get going. Um, other than that, we got Big Duck season opening up in November again, <laughs> and rifle starting. Okay, whatever, Justin. Anyways, but uh, definitely going to get some video of that. So we are uh, getting things rolling, rolling steady. And um, we're just, we're trucking. Uh, it's slow and steady right now. I mean, we we got up to over 600 members now again. Thank you all, guys. Appreciate that. Um, going to probably be doing another giveaway here soon. Andrew, what's up, bud? There's another one of our sponsors that's Redbeard. Um, we'll be getting goose calls from him when we get the money together. We um, we're more than we we need to. We should probably do a video of us shooting our bows. Yep, Soon. definitely do a video of us shooting our bows. Um, you'll actually see my old. What, what year is it again? Like a 90s model, 80s. I thought it was an 80s model. 80s, 80s or 90s model Hoyt. I shoot an old Hoyt I actually got from Roy several years ago, and uh, things that's things still a beast. I, I'm not going to complain about it. Got I it. love it. And I've got a, I've got a uh, Matthew C7. So I mean, we're not shooting high tech, up to date bows. That way, you don't think, oh, we gotta have best of the best. No. We're, we don't shoot best of the best. We shoot what we want, what we need. Oh, I mean, it, don't get me just, wrong. If I could shoot a freaking track, oh, just oh, I would. Oh, God, yeah. That, but, oh, yeah. But, you know, we'll get there eventually one day. Maybe. <laughs> but, uh, bow season's coming up. Rifle season's coming up. We'll do some videos and tips on deer hunting. Uh, do some video tips on, actually, big ducks, because... During big duck season down here in Texas, they pretty much already been through the ringer. So we got to hunt a little bit different down here. Yeah. Yeah. It's like the gauntlet down here. Yeah. But uh, we're going to have a, quite a few videos. We'll be going out to just west of Waco by about 45 minutes to an hour, roughly, depending on what lake we hunt. Um, we're definitely heading up Aquila Lake. It's supposed to be a really good duck lake. Mm -hmm. uh, Charlie's, Charlie Spence and us, we're going to be hunting together. I don't know... Where we're hunting just yet, that's on Charlie. Charlie's going to set that up. That should be a really good hunt, too. Uh, we're going to be hunting with Alexander in January, as long as we get things going the way they're supposed to. Hmm. That's right, hmm. Andrew. That's right, brother man. But uh, in January, we're supposed to be going on a goose hunt with Goose Reapers out in Lubbock or Amarillo. Can't wait for that, too. We just got to get things going on. That's top secret. That's right. I, I know you're about top secret, Charlie. We ain't going to give it away. All right, CJ. Appreciate it, bub. Thank you. And uh, so it, there's going to be a lot more videos coming as long as we get the when we get our cameras going. Um, that's been the holdup. I got Royce moved up here, as you all know, a couple weeks ago. So in that transition, we had to sit there and pack a lot of stuff, obviously. So we lost the GoPro for the time being. So when we get the new, the new cameras up, which Oops. I'm trying to get mine within the next week or two, I'll have a new another camera. Him too. So we'll get y'all the videos up. Hey, Jason, what's going on, brother? Also, um, probably going to get a couple fishing videos out, just straight up fishing and some bow fishing because, you know, we're both big bow fishermen before it gets too cold for us because we don't like being out in the cold. Sounds good to me. Sounds Andrew. good to me, Andrew. I'm up with that. I'm definitely good with that. I'm sure all of us are from Double C. What's up, Jason? How you doing, brother man? So, uh, it'd be our first year to hunt honkers. That's going to be interesting. And that was a mosquito. Where did you get it? That wasn't. What is that? I don't know, but it had a stinger on it, and that was weird looking. I might be what stung my kid. Anyway, sorry. We both got an ADHD on that one. <laughs> hey, Larry, what's going on, brother? Long time, man. Hope you're doing good. But uh, we're going to be go getting our goose calls, hopefully, here, if we can get the funds going. We're going to rely on y'all to help us get funds going, y'all. I mean, the more decals we sell, that means the more hats we can get and the more shirts we can get. 
Oh, we're good with that, Andrew. Try, dude, we we got a stupid duck story. One year, that was that. Yeah, we'll, we'll talk about that one later. We'll get we'll get off of this here soon. But y'all need to leave it in the comments. Let us know what y'all want to see. What y'all want to hear, see us talk about. We have no problem doing tips. That's basically what we're. CJ, we're down, brother. Just hit me up. Yeah, and I'll get I'll get uh, get everything going with you on that for us. But uh, what was I saying? Oh, the duck story. Any so. um, if you have any questions or you want to hear about anything, um, we can pretty well cover mo a majority. Cover of it. cover most of it, yeah, and answer any questions that you have. Um. I mean, if you have questions about fishing, I'm I'm the guy for you. Um, hunting hogs or deer, he can he can give you some, but I can answer him too. But he's the archery guy. I'm the rifle guy. He got me in the archery. Let's put it that way. So yeah, for sure. But, but it's okay. It's all good because we do it all now. But uh, yeah, so leave in the comments. See what tell us what you want to hear. If we y'all want to see us go once a week, we'll go live once a week. Talk to y'all. Whole nine yards. I'm down. I'm down. If you come up, we can do a shoot off. Winter shaves. I shave the beard. You cut a mole. Okay. Although I'm not gonna have a mole or a beard because the wife don't like me having it. But late season bass lures, brother. Mm. Well, I mean, it depends on what you're fishing. If you're fishing rivers or if you if you're fishing lake. Uh, if you're fishing lake, main lake, I mean, I would go deeper water. Um, definitely deeper water with a Carolina rig, something like that with a big, bigger, I should say, um, like a brush hog or a, a, a dinger. Um, but, I mean, usually I'm fishing deeper water, colder water. But, um, yeah, I mean, I... We don't really fish too much later season. I really like the uh, the spawn early, early, um, early spring, mid spring, early sim, early summer. Those are my favorite times. We can use poppers, you know, frogs, pretty much anything top water, um, crankbaits. I've done a uh, a crankbait on a Carolina rig one time with uh in deeper water about 40 foot of water or so it actually worked pretty good <laughs> it's actually, called experiment and trial and error it's it all actually out. worked actually worked pretty good they were suspended it was uh they were suspended about 25 30 foot of water and it was 40 foot i didn't have anything that would dive 35 foot so naturally i just kind of improvised and made a big leader and it worked out but uh yeah, go ahead. Uh, if you want to, you can message me, and uh, and we can talk more about it if you want to. That way, you get a comment on here and stuff. Either way, and we'll do videos. I mean, y'all say y'all want tips on whatever it is. We'll do a video on the tips. We'll go live. We'll talk about it. Talk with y'all about it. We didn't do it for till season. We did a video on YouTube and Facebook. I shared it on both, and that's how we're going to do our our big videos. Not a problem, brother. You're welcome. But uh, when we do our big videos, it'll be on YouTube and on our Facebook. So make sure you go find our YouTube channel. It's Double C Outdoors, just like our page, our main page, and the group. So y'all like it up. Show us some love. We want to show y'all some love. Y'all give us give us some ideas for some sponsors, guys. I mean, we're, we're open to anybody, really. I mean, if y'all know anybody that does apparel, we, we would like to have a camo apparel um sponsor and, and we don't uh, need nothing big i mean it, uh, no our, we prefer our, we prefer a, a small, small a small um company, company. yeah that's what we're looking for our, our our deal is with all the companies that we start with now no matter how big we get how many how well we do we are going to be doing sticking with these companies no matter what because these companies have grown with us. They've trusted us. We're trusting them. They're giving us all kinds of awesome, awesome deals on everything they've got. 
That's one reason I'm, I'm such a big supporter of Dam- Mr. Damien Herbert from Herbert's Custom De- Decoy Rigs. I mean, he, he hooked us up good. and They're sweet. They, they're they amazing. I'm, I'm ready to use them. mine. I'm ready to use mine this weekend. So, and just like, you know, our call, call lanyards and totes, they're paracord, but that's what we like. We don't like the leather. We don't like any of that stuff just because we – do sometimes get in waist deep water or deeper depending on what we have to do i'm always in waist deep water i'm short remember well yeah you're, <laughs> you're short. but all right andrew well just heads up y'all redbeard's custom decoy uh i'm sorry redbeard custom calls is doing a duck call giveaway yeah i just totally screwed that up so y'all go check out redbeard he's gonna be doing it for halloween so go check him out tell him we sent you Hi, wife. Yes, I'm still here. It's all it's about to be done, if you can hear me. But, uh, so, yeah, I mean, y'all got any ideas for sponsors? We're not begging y'all to do it. It's just if y'all can think of somebody we can't think of, shoot us a message. Let us know. Yep. And like I said, y'all help us out. We'll send y'all some free stuff. Once I get hats in, I won't do too many hats, but I'll we'll give away some hats, give away some shirts when we get enough shirts in. So, there y'all go, guys. There's our update. You can stop right now, ma'am. So, anyway, sorry about that. That's our update, y'all. Sweet, dude. Y'all, Redbeard just did get, did us a solid. You mentioned that Double C sent y'all over and that y'all are with us in the group. He's going to give y'all 10% off your purchase. I mean, straight straight up custom calls. They're great. He's got some that are pre-made. And, okay, got to like our actual main page to get that discount. So, go over to our Double C main page, Double C Outdoors, like it up, and you get 10% off your your call order from Redbeard. And I'm telling you, his fat boys are awesome. I love his fat boys. And then his his crossing guards, um, his goose calls, I mean, they're all sweet. They are, and I don't know where Brian's at, but he does our, our he's from Driftless. That's our, that's our <laughs> duck call sponsor. Love his duck calls too. They're, they look sweet. They sound good. And when we get our customs next year, they're going to be even sweeter. <laughs> Both of them. Yep. All right, CJ, I'll, I'll throw a post up in the Lodge group. Appreciate it, brother. Both of them. Deuce calls and. Yeah. They're going to be sweet. They're going to be all sweet because uh, just a little heads up and a little hint, hint. We're going retro with our goose calls, y'all. And it's only going to be 10 of them. Three of them are already spoken for. So, four. Well, I'm sorry. Yeah, four are already spoken for. Four are already spoken for. So that means there's going to be six left. They are going to be serial numbered. They'll be one through 10. Oh, uh, Andrew, I appreciate it, man. Man, that's awesome. I appreciate it, brother. Straight up. I seriously appreciate it. But uh, they're going to be serial numbered, so they will be a collector's item as well. Um, but when we get them, we, we'll let y'all know. And uh, they're up for grabs. They're going. To, it's going to be first come, first serve. Not saving it for anybody. Uh, you you want it, you get it then. Uh, that's just how it's going to have to go with that set. And the great thing is with Redbeard is we've got a deal worked out where we will customize all the calls we get from them. They will have our logo on the band that goes around the call. And they will be whatever shape, colors, whatever we come up with. So there are going to be some unique custom colors in the future. These are the retro ones because we won the retro first. The next run of 10, same deal. So y'all stay tuned. This is Double C. We're signing out. Y'all have a great night.